Alrighty guys, welcome back to a new video. We're at SeaWorld Orlando. Yes guys, so we're here at the SeaWorld Orlando. It's been a while. Um, since like the last year, I believe. Um, we're only doing this because I can kill time for Halloween Horror Nights. As you guys see, I'm wearing stuff for Halloween Horror Nights, so yeah. And look guys, the baggy, the bag of Horror Nights is coming. So yeah, let's get going. Just before we get inside, look guys, pipe, pipeline, the that one roller coaster is actually being built over here. So this is another new ride that's coming to SeaWorld's Little Orlando uh, roller coaster park. So yeah guys, but yeah, we're about to go to SeaWorld Orlando, have some little fun before we go to Horror Nights, so yeah. Oh, by the way guys, it just opened like a few I just got off of the plane, by the way, just to let you guys know, so, yeah, I'm very, like, I mean, I'm very energetic, but I'm very tired at the same time. So, yeah, guys, we're on our way to Icebreaker, or one of the newer, newer rides, so, yeah. You know what, we're going to check the area. There we go. Watch way, which way to the candy? That's a little too little. There you guys go. Oh my god. Big orca. Oh my god. Look. Now it's RJ. Yeah, I had to do it to you, RJ. I'm, I'm sorry. I had to do that to you. But yeah. Alright, guys. So we got the little, few little trees already open. And by the way, guys, we're heading Girl, that direction. Get out of there. That's the newest roller coaster. Yes, guys, we are taking down a lot of good roller coasters. For example, like that one, the Kraken. So we're just only doing the roller coasters and all that. We're not doing Journey to Atlantis. We're not doing, we might do Manta Tay. So yeah, we're just trying to kill time before we have to, to go. So yeah, Icebreaker, we might ride like a few times. Cause yeah. Oh, by the way, should it open, uh, this pathway will open at 10. But yeah, look at that. The ride has all the tracks and all that. And Jesus freaking Christ, it looks beautiful. Can't wait to see what they do with them. Alright guys, the gates just opened. Here we go. The new roller coaster. Oh, I can't wait. This freaking roller coaster is going to be gonna be like somewhat like that one but yeah the, the roller coasters and see where Orlando just keeps improving improving but oh look I did not expect that to ever happen by the way guys um I don't know if you've seen it when I went over that turn uh make it went over that turn so yeah we're about to do this ride I'm about to let you guys know uh, I'm not gonna be able to film on that I mean, if I had my GoPro but yeah but I did not expect for me to go to SeaWorld. So the title of this video is Unexpected uh, Trip to SeaWorld Orlando. But yeah, guys, um, we might do Manta, by the way. I'm just, I think I might. I'm not sure if it was. I want to, like, have, like, the momentum for Mako and the Kraken and all that. So, yeah, most likely we're going to be doing the, the core ride. Like, this one most of the uh, make them and by the way guys this is yeah this is sick i'm back here oh look hey guys y'all i don't know if you've seen it right there guys let me tell you that ride was freaking amazing i went it was it was that good that i went on like like twice on there but uh i i'm like i'm like enjoy the ride like i have my hands up and all that and i look guys i'm sorry if i can't record but at the same time i just don't want to get calls to get in trouble and all that and but yeah ten dollars for a freaking thing man why does he put price ten dollars just for one area but yeah guys we're gonna think what i'm gonna do is uh next time we're gonna well what i'm gonna do is put it somewhere where no one can not see it and yeah Oh, we're not doing that little roller coaster, by the way. I know, I know we did it in 
in San Diego, but we won't be doing it out here. So yeah. Oh guys, we went on the day that their their hollow screams is right there, but I'm gonna I'm gonna ask you guys this question right quick. Should I next year like like instead of instead of doing uh, Universal Studios Hollywood or in Orlando, which is the reason that's why I'm here, guys, is because for the Orlando one. So yeah, um, what we're gonna do is probably probably next year we're probably gonna do not to Berry Farm and then the uh, other ones. So yeah, I don't know. Uh, maybe SeaWorld is in play. Hollow Scream right there, see Orlando, all that. But yeah. So I think some of the rides are open. Yeah, we're doing Mega Ball, I guess. Just to let you guys know. So yeah, we're gonna we're gonna go see how I can get over there. That way we can get started. But yeah, uh, hope you guys are enjoying this. Okay, so I have to go to Affinity Falls. I forgot. Okay, guys. So we're gonna show you guys how wet they get. All right. So here comes, there's people over there, right? Look at that. That's why I told you I didn't want to get wet. But yeah, uh, so they come, so those seeds right there are gonna get picked up right over there. And then you're gonna get uh, drenched. So yeah, I'm not staying for it because yeah, we got we got a beautiful thing. A little a little hill over there. So yeah, we're gonna go, we're gonna go on the hill and go have some fun. All right, guys, here they come. All right, so they got their little... Oh, look at it. Oh, yeah. I told you, but... Yeah, it's something different than the one in San Diego. This one's way better. But yeah, guys, on our way to Mako. All right, guys, so we're currently on the, the lane. I'm in here for it. But yeah guys, hopefully you guys are gonna enjoy the, the videos and all that, like the Florida content and all that. Because yeah, it's freaking gonna be amazing for this next few, three days. So you not only get SeaWorld, but Horror Nights and Islands of Adventure. So yeah, probably it's not a bad day today. All right, just got off of Mako, freaking awesome ride. I was, uh, when the, when the hills, they take so long, so I'm just like, I was like this all the entire time. As soon as the, as soon as the drop came, I grabbed my heads up and I was like, whoo, the hill, the air time though, Jesus freaking Christ, it was, it was freaking awesome guys, like seriously, I was kind of a little, little like nervous, so, yeah, it was my, like my first time back on the ride, so yeah, I'm trying to get used to this ride, as much before I go on the, like one that's like, one that like so it's gonna go like this like all the way like that so yeah i'm trying my best but yeah <laughs> look at that guys there you go John. but yeah guys um hope you guys are enjoying the vlog um i'm probably gonna stop somewhere to get something to eat yeah, your boy has not not ate since yesterday before I went on this flight. And by the way, guys, just to let you guys know, you guys better be appreciative of what I just did because today I wouldn't be here without someone helping me out trying to get my my pass. So, yeah, guys, I'll probably go back there soon, but I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm most likely going to get uh, my food, like food or something. I'm very starving and all that. So yeah. So that's the basic idea. But yeah, we're gonna look for it. Oh wait. I know where charging places are, like, but we need to go get something to munch down on. So yeah. Alright guys, so change of plans right quick. So the place right there, I'm not sure what time is it gonna be available. But yeah, I'm gonna go and crack in. Then, then we'll see if we can get something. So yeah. Okay, the only reason why I'm going on the Kraken is because when I was little, 
No, that. That used to not be green. It used to be a different color. So, yeah. All right, guys. So, we just got off of Kraken. Uh, Kraken wasn't bad, but at the same time, it did a little bit hurt me and all that. So, yeah. So, um, you guys know in hindsight events, it hurt. So, I'm probably going to do, like, Mako and that uh, other ride, too. So, who knows? I don't know, I might not do Manta because depending on how rough it is too. But yeah guys, I'm, I need something. I need something very bad, so we're gonna go get something to eat. Okay guys, so we got a chicken sandwich with fries and a Coke. Total was $18.99, not bad. So yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna eat this and then find a charging place for it, so yeah. Be back. Oh my god, guys. I just killed that. I don't like tomato. tomatoes. Oh yeah. Alright guys, so the chicken sandwich was good. The bread was very cold and I don't know why it was cold. And all that, so the plan is now is to sit around, enjoy the nature of Florida because I don't get to experience this because I live in the whole entire different side of the, the country, Las Vegas. So yeah, <laughs> I'm sorry, but yeah, guys. Um, the food was good. Um, like I said, it was $18.99 because I had the season pass person, and like I can go to any like parks in the around the world and all that. So. Yeah, we're gonna stop at a charging place right now. And yeah, I don't have, I don't, I don't need to call the hotel. So I don't need to call my hotel till like, like 12 ish or one ish. So we can be here all day. I mean, not all day. We have um, that. And look at this cool little thing. I don't know. It's, it is considering. Um, I am very thinking about doing that. But yeah, guys, we might ride uh, as soon as we get done. We're gonna probably ride like, I don't know, Mako again. So what I mean is, I don't know is that I don't know if I'm gonna be doing that and all that, so yeah. Mm. We might do Icebreaker again. Icebreaker was amazing. Oh, look at these trick-or-treaters. They so cute. There's trick-or-treaters out here. But yeah, guys, this is a uh, trick-or-treat for the little ones before the little scare, the scare thing happens. So yeah, overall, this is going good. This is going good. Uh, as you guys see, the trees are popping up. So yeah, how about that, guys? We're gonna, as soon as we get back, we'll go home. We'll go do animal encounters, like the shark one and all that. And then probably do some shows while I'm at it too, because it's not fair for these animals. But just because I'm trying to enjoy these rides that I don't get to like see in like my own city. Okay guys, so um, I'm just sitting down right quick because that's where the charging thing is at. Just right over there, uh, there's the monster storm, little slasher alley. Oh yeah, but yeah guys, uh, this area looks, this area is very nice. You get like the, um, the little, where is it? Right there, you get to see like the, for the drop of uh, Mako. You get like a little cool little exclusive views of, of the ride right here. And when it goes, turning back into the station when it just goes around there yeah i also hope you guys uh, respect what i'm doing too because i want to be doing this without my own uh she she did she did uh give me my sea world pass so it, that's the reason why i'm here otherwise i would be probably probably i don't know so yeah guys appreciate i appreciate her just give it to me 
because that, that just helps me out really, really good because I would, I would have probably sat at the airport all day waiting for it. And I'd rather not wait at the airport. I'm very like tired and all that, so. Yeah, I'm kind of happy that we're here right now, relaxing and all that. Yeah, this is, look, we gotta relax and recharge. Like, recharge your phone and all that. Don't worry, guys. I'm gonna re uh, charge my phone. And I'm gonna show you the view. But yeah, um, looks like they're gonna be building that new pipeline. So everyone, uh, so they finally move out. Oh, finally, but anyways, no, I just, I was, because I didn't want to use that one big area because it's not even half shade. And plus I get some pair. But if you guys want to know where this is, this is like a charge area. And yeah, uh, it's right near Mako and right near Infinity Falls, which is like very that way. So, um. As you guys see, let me teach you a tutorial. Hey, no, don't know how to charge phones. All right, here you go. Ready? And you grab your phone. Phone charger. Like you see, this. Put it in there and that should be charging. All right, guys, so see? Lying in that one little area. Right next to this little show thing right next to you. I think the lion show? Whatever the show is. It's meant for Halloween, that's all I know. Every single time Halloween event. And so so far, no other person told me. No one didn't say nothing. But yeah guys, just to let you know. Yeah. Kinda got those kinda got those charged. God look at my beard fam. Oh guys um Want to let you guys know, um, content for adventures are going to be very difficult. Just to let y'all know, so, yeah. By the way, we're going to wait for a few more. We're going to wait for a few minutes. Probably going to go on Instagram or all that or something, I don't know. Probably see what the NFL scores are, because, yeah, I keep up with my NFL. So, yeah. All right, guys, be back. All right, guys, so we're currently, uh, Charged the phone. It was 29. I think the percentage was 29 and all that. So yeah, we we got it. But we're gonna go see some animals and all that. So yeah. Hey okay, guys, so we got a little animal. Oh look. You guys oh my god though. But you guys should see this in real life though. This is a big one. It's like right now he'll be like that's how big he is right now in the human eye. Yeah, look at them. Oh, big fish. Look at all these sharks. But yeah, we're gonna go. We must be sleeping. So yeah. Stingray, sharks. Just a lot of sharks. But yeah, we're about to go to the one. Uh, the enclosure for the sharks. All right, guys. Long before dinosaurs, long before birds, long before us, there were sharks. Look at this. Oh my lord, guys! Look at that one. They're very active. A lot of tuna. Oh my god, look at them. Oh my gosh. Hello, Colin. This one here. Lionfish. Yeah, but a lot of lionfish. Uh, not no sharks, I see, but they're, they're the invasive and species of the southern east of Florida, like area. Yeah. These uh, fish is in there, there's fishes in there, like lionfish and all that. There's more, oh, look, sharks. Here's like some of the sharks, like bull sharks and all that. So let's keep on going. Alrighty guys, 
Well, short gray whites. You know that? And yeah, this is like a little area for like kids and all that. That's pretty good because they don't. For me, it's like a little cool to show. See, look, he's. See, look, they're happy. Look at that. Very white sharks and all that. Oh, here are the bigger ones. That's a sawfish. Oh, look. This one coming all the other way. Here's all the fishes that are in here. Like a lot of grouper, sand target shark, small tips, sawfish, red drum, black tips. Yeah. There's a little sand tiger shark right there. One of the most very safe. Very mean. Look at another one. Oh, fishy. Uh, Wow. Oh, stingray action. Lazy bots right there. But yeah, you can see the cool interesting facts. Oh, I thought that was a great white. That's a mako right there. Here's, here's a whale shark. Imagine three six ton elephants. Him? Their everyday moves is every single time, guys. Don't trash where you splash. Don't choose substance to see food. It's part of laws that about it. Means don't kill them. Don't kill fish that that don't need to be killed. Means, guys, like uh, for example, fish. Fish are friends. For real, they, they are friends. They're not no very suspicious of us. We should we eat them. We, I love fish, but at the same time, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna eat the fish that uh, should not be eating. But yeah, guys, um, here we're currently around here with the right next to the hollow scream area and all that. Um, I'm very tired. For those who do not know. Very tired that I. Then when I probably get to the hotel, I might go to sleep for about a few hours. I don't know. And then get ready for my horror night trip. So yeah, very well excited for that. But don't worry, guys. Um, you don't have to worry about the content being there too much. So yeah. See, guys, this is how very chill it is for me today. Like, like don't worry, I'm having fun worth it at the same time but look at this you have like a good freaking view of the whole entire like this side of the park you got the orca stadium right there you got mako that way you got infinity falls that way a little bit i don't know if you back over there is like sesame street and there's icebreaker right there then the new roller coaster comes makes it's gonna make life fun with zero i feel like zero is gonna step up their game and I feel like soon enough it's gonna get to the point where this place is gonna be very beautiful and all that and I think SeaWorld might outbeat Disney.
just saying guys overall disney needs to step up their game because ever since ever since tron's been like clean up and all that and they haven't done anything yeah like i said tron steps it up i mean when tron opens disney will probably get a good start I don't know, I'm probably going to get a lot of people hating on me about me talking about Disney and all that. But it's the, serious, the seriousness of the matter. SeaWorld is cheaper for people. I, I have a little bit basically have a season pass. And the season pass are way cheaper than Disney. And Disney keeps pricing up their prices. So that's asking you, what, what should Disney do? Start doing way better. Look, yeah, the attractions are not worth of how much a theme park is. So yeah, that's all I'm just saying. Look at that. Kids are watching little baby dolphins right there. And look at this. This is like interacting with, with it. I'm not sure if there's any inside. Um, okay, there's... Oh, there's one right there. Look at it. There's two of them. I'm sorry. Wow, oh, look at those babies. Very beautiful. See, uh, my I was talking to my co-workers the other day, and I was telling people about that. I was even talking to the Uber driver today. I'm like, I'm not even sure if uh, Disney is not even worth paying for anymore. Because you're in a, like, you're still in enough pain. A hundred dollars for a ticket, plus the genie class, and plus all the rest. So what's gonna, so what's going on? Oh, by the way, guys, I'm going to stop at Coaster Co Coffee, or whatever, the coffee. Uh, I think it's Starbucks, I'm not sure. All right, guys, so I see uh, some treats, tasty treats. So we're gonna review it while we're getting our order. So as you see, there's like cupcakes right there. And cookies, like cups and all that. And look, cookies, brownies, and donuts. Oh guys, so I, I'm not sure if I showed you that. That's how much how high, how high is. That's how much amount. That's the whole entire replica of the roller coaster. Anyway, this is what they were doing. I guess building for the one ride they're cracking this is the coaster cafe area it's like a little starbucks so yeah okay here it is guys look at this oh my god just want to let you guys know due to me going on that long plane you know i need that caramel macchiato so yeah we're gonna drink it right now oh my god i need that Badly. This helps me. Coffee helps me. I have literally like um, monster energy, and this now, this is good. So, yeah, I'm very excited. Now, now, now I need this to use this board tonight. So, yeah. Alright, guys, so football just started. Uh, and I'm still having my coffee. Very well done. Just, we're now just walking around and all that, so yeah. Mm. Any, anything over here? Anything? Oh, there they are. Just little shuggies and all that. Look, and there's a dolphin over here. Oh, there you guys go. They're petting them. Yeah, so. This is reminds me of like a little, little, like little San Diego, but at the same time, this one is way better than the one in San Diego. So yeah. Let's look guys, my Uber driver tells me, he was like, hmm, uh, Matthew, did, is this your first time visiting? I'm like, no. I hit it my, like, I don't even know how many times. Look, they're doing, that's cute. Hey, I'm getting jealous. Okay, guys, so um, I just want to ask this question to you guys. As you know, SeaWorld Orlando 
has more of a bigger property than the one in San Diego. My my home uh, my home park basically because that is my home park. So my question to you guys is: Do you think Super Orlando is gonna keep expanding its theme park elements of it, or are we, or is it gonna be? San Diego gonna be rising because as you guys know they're gonna have like a white breaker version of the Antarctic and uh, my own home park which is San Diego. for those who do not know guys my home parks are Universal Studios Hollywood not so very farm and all those other theme parks um, hmm. Universal Universal Orlando and all these ones in here are are not my home parks they're parks that i just visit almost like almost i mean i try to like almost every single day i mean not every single day but almost almost um, a year wow look wonder how or what are those how are they doing those bubbles oh my god they're... look there's another area Oh, so here you go. So, right near the little rescue area, you see these little, little chicken feet, candy areas. All you need to see is can, like a candy. <laughs> hey, look! You get these nice little oh, bubbles. They just fade into. It. See, look. They just grab. You just poke them, and then that's it. Oh. They're right next. It's right next to the the little festival thing. Is right near, right near um, during to Atlantis. But yeah, we pretty much walked through a circle. We pretty much walked through a circle. Look, guy brings candy. So this is this is where it starts. All the way in there, and you just go all the way back. And then you got a. And you got a little trick or treat fest. Cause yeah, they um I don't know, they don't get to kids don't go some of these kids don't go to the theme parks to celebrate. They go on the Halloween on their little lots and all that just to do it. So yeah, and look. People are going there. Wow. I can't no sir. Especially, especially that front though. No, sir. That front? No. As you know, the front row is gonna do it. Now watch this. The front was splashing very well. I don't know. Okay, so they stop because they have to wait till these people have to wait till they get out there. I don't know what's going on. Must be uh, having little issues or something. But yeah, that's that's the most wet spot right there, right over there, and then right there. Oh, we're about to have people. So let me end this. All right, guys, pretty soon. Oh, there they go. Look at that. That's crazy. Good job, Florida. Oh, okay, guys, so uh, I just want to tell you guys about something right quick. So, as you know, I was supposed to do the Halloween Horror Night, and yeah, um, we're doing. Yes, we don't worry, guys. We're still gonna do it. Don't don't stress, guys. Because yeah, we're like, oh no, you did something. No, it's because uh, I made little decision plans. So today, I mean, today's vlog is SeaWorld. Tomorrow's vlog, or whenever we post that one. 
We might post it tomorrow, but Holy Horror Nights in Orlando. And then after that, we're going to Islands of Adventure and that includes our day. But yeah guys, um, we're gonna be doing the same thing uh, tomorrow. Well, yeah, after. So, oh no, not not your guys' day, my day uh, tomorrow. I'm gonna have to do a little short day of Universal and then get back to the airport so that way I can get to there. So yeah guys, um, a little walk, a little walk wasn't bad. Let's go hit up some rides or something, I don't know. Um, Maybe in um, Mako, I'm not sure. To be very honest with you guys, the painting on the new uh, Manta is very sick. I don't know why, but it is very sick. But yeah, guys, we just keep walking until we find something we should do. So yeah, look. Going in this pretzel room. Okay, guys, so the best war, best thing that ever happens in this ride is that uh, when you do this turn back to the station, I believe. No, you do this uh, course screw right here, right? It goes that goes back solar. This this one right here goes right over here, and then makes that turn, and then goes right back to the station, right? So oh, hopefully they can show the demonstration, or hopefully it's still there. But they used to have like, uh, they have these like water blasters. And as soon as they blast you, they'll get you wet. Oh, hey, it's Big Witch. Hopefully, good to see them. All right, guys, give me a few seconds, okay? They're supposed to come this, supposed to come this direction, okay? All right. Here they come. And the brake. See? Okay, that felt good. That felt good. See? The ride, the ride. Oh no, let me explain. So the ride basically what it does is that the tips of the of the ride helps helps out the water splash you. What I didn't know was that there was gonna be mist and all that after that. So it really helps out when it's very hot. I mean, it's not hot right now, it's like 70 degrees. But it's not really hot. I'm wearing shorts and all that, so that's how you can tell. I mean, it was a little bit cold because uh, Florida gets cold. Florida gets somewhat cold, like uh, California and all that. And yeah, but yes, guys. Um, for those who are asking, um, my new plan for next year is to go do Halloween Horror Nights in Hollywood with people. By the way, uh, Universal Orlando. I just want to see how it would do by myself. So yeah, um, if it's good, I will be doing it. But yeah, not to scare farm, we'll make a appearance again. So yeah. Okay guys, so the best thing that I have never done, which um, was, me and my cousin were watching a video of it, the wild Antarctic. Hopefully it's open. And yeah. The breeze is very helping a lot. There is actually two cranes on site, but today is a Sunday, which I believe they don't work on Sundays and all that so yeah look at that nice little the launch pads right there they're gonna launch so they're gonna launch you on that thing and I like I like the color because it reminds me of the hamper so yeah and then another interesting fact guys is do you know that Jaws 3 was filmed in this area like in this water theater areas. Like right here was where the shark and all that attack, the flamingos and all that. So yeah. Like like I said guys, I'm very excited for that. Well so I should be here next year as well when that park opens because we will be okay guys. I do have an announcement for park 
a park announcement. I am gonna be going to Universal Studios, Florida, and Islands of Adventure, and SeaWorld San Diego, uh, SeaWorld Orlando. Um, it's either spring or summer, I'm not sure. Me and my brother and my cousin was talking about doing a Florida like trip. So yeah guys, just I'll let y'all know, but right now it's a little bit official. Uh, that's the only big thing that's gonna happen. Um, if you guys ask me if, uh, to do Iron Gwazi, that will be happening next year. I just need to schedule it out, figure it out, see if anyone wants to come with me, so yeah. All right, so I'm throwing you in the locker. Um, we're gonna go on icebreaker. See ya. Yes, guys, come forward if you guys want to. But well, I just got off of it twice now. I, I love the ride. Like, that's what I'm saying. Like, what is, what is, what are they doing wrong? Um, so yeah, guys, um, we're not on our way to go to Mako. The little charging area, or the um, charging area I was, charging up for a little bit, called my hotel. Because apparently they told me to call at two now, so now it's just a waiting game. Plus I'm gonna probably ride Mako for the last time, so yeah. And guys, hope you guys do enjoy these type of videos. Um, we will be making more trips in the near future, just uh this was my last probably one if i go to california it might be for the super tender land or all that mm -hmm. but uh or i might be going like i said the bush garden thing i might make a little thing about bush gardens tampa so who knows i'll let y'all know i'll let y'all know in the announcements and all that so, yeah um, let's go to that area. Alright guys, so right next to Pretty Falls. Look, Mr. Gator hiding now. Must be a little scare zone and all that. So yeah. Okay guys, so that was that was fun. Uh, I was a little bit nervous. I, I still did the same thing when I grabbed me right there. I don't know why, but... That was fun. Uh, I had to end it off with makeup because makeup was a fun ride and all that. Um, yeah, guys, it's time for me to leave. I gotta get, gotta go to the hotel, get some like rest before horror nights. So yes, guys, um, I'm gonna get me a drink by the way too. So don't worry, the video's not ended. I'm just getting a soda and all that. So I'll be right back, okay? Alrighty guys, what a successful day at SeaWorld. I'm gonna be heading out to go to the hotel. Gonna get my reservation and all that done. And then that way I can go relaxing on the bed for a little bit. Probably take a nap and relax. So I'm just saying is that I'm heading out right now and outro right. Now, thank you guys so much for enjoying this video. If you guys do, make sure you guys hit that like button. Make sure you guys subscribe. Turn on the notification so you guys don't miss any videos. And yeah, can't wait to come back here again. But this time for the Pipeline roller coaster. Bye, right, guys. Have a wonderful day. Stay awesome. Love you. Peace on out.